Hello everyone! In a previous video, we looked at how to use the keyword over in custom expressions. But did you also know that you can use it when adding calculated column? Let's see how you can master this skill and what are the differences with custom expressions. Theory first. You can perform calculations on your data and display the results as values in a new column that is added to the data table. In the expression used for the calculation, you can use an overstatement. However, using an overstatement in calculated columns works slightly differently from using it in custom expressions. In calculated columns, the over expression is used to calculate separate, fixed values for different groups and the over expression might cause the data to be sliced into fewer pieces. Note that calculated columns are always calculated on all values in the column, no matter how you filter your data. When working with calculated columns, there are no axes available to navigate over Instead, you use node navigation function to refer to values in a column and calculate one result for each value. Note that the resulting value for each group will be shown on all rows that were included in the calculation. Let's have a quick example now. I have some London Airbnb data with columns for price, room and property type, number of reviews and reviews score. It's often very useful to look at number of reviews. As you can see, some listings have one review only and some others have above 100. Let's go ahead and add a new calculated column. I'll create a simple calculated column on average of number of reviews. This new column will show the same result on all rows in the data table, that being average number of reviews. If you instead type average number of reviews over room type, you can see the aggregated value of the number of reviews per each category of room type. For example, entire home apartment has on average 19.04 number of reviews. This is the mean of all entire home apartments type and it's displayed on every row that has apartment home type. On contrary, you have 32.83 average number of reviews for private room. Because you have a column which contains an aggregated value, this means that it's probably not suitable to use such calculated column in aggregating visualizations, for example, to show in a bar chart. For this, you should refer to the previous quick tip explaining how to use over in custom expressions. Note that the new column values will not change when data is filtered out. For example, if the data row at the top is filtered out, the calculated column values for private room will still be 32.83. In the expression used for calculating a column, you can use the overstatement in combination with a node navigation method, such as previous or all. And now you know everything about over keyword. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will see you in the next quick tip.